my answer here might shock you to the core, but I've got to reveal that attorneys do have a bit of an ego at times, especially prosecutors, not defense attorneys. Prosecutors have a lot of power, and I think with power, we don't always get humility, right? I can't tell you how many prosecutors I've seen sort of pound their chest after their guilty verdict, their head swells, and it's like a football mascot head. I mean, you can't get through a single door, but courtrooms have double doors. So, you know, that's a good thing. But I'm going to answer your question by telling you about a case that a prosecutor did put their ego aside, did the right thing. It was Natan v. State. And this prosecutor took Natan to jury trial. Natan was found guilty of ag stalking, aggravated stalking, and arson. Prison cases gone by. But a few days after this verdict, this prosecutor writes the judge and the defense attorney a letter. The reason the letter was written was because the bailiff came to the prosecutor and said, look, I talked to the jury about some of the evidence. It was improperly marked, but hey, don't worry about it. I took care of it. I properly marked the evidence. Well, here's the thing. Nobody gets to talk to the jury in the middle of a trial about the evidence or about the testimony, not even a bailiff. No talk about the case whatsoever. Here's what bailiffs get to say. Who needs to use the restroom? Who's hungry? What do you want to eat? That's what they get to say. It's practically scripted. You don't get to change evidence tags and all that like what happened here. All of this on the bailiff's part was innocent, by the way. There were no bad motives here. But this communication with the jury violated our rules. It means Natan's convictions are going to be thrown out. And we know, because we know prosecutors, that this prosecutor worked hard to convict Natan. And like every prosecutor, when that guilty verdict came out late at night, there was an office-wide email. Oh, I got another guilty verdict. Hooray for me. All you bitches are out to eat dinner and I'm getting guilty verdicts. That's not what was really said, I don't think. But it sounds like that in my mind. And when the prosecutor heard this from the bailiff, there's that sinking feeling that this verdict's going to be thrown out. So my congratulations to this prosecutor for doing the right thing. The appellate court overturned Natan's verdicts and they got to start again and do another, do another trial. I like it and I'm telling you about this prosecutor because the right thing was done, even though it cost them a verdict. It's a beautiful thing.